Ari, how long did it take you to uh, buy into your coordinator's uh, hustle all the time mentality? And have you bought into it? I assume you've had to. Yeah, I think since I, uh, since I first got drafted here, that's something I, I, I bought into. I'm not actually executing that. That's a different thing. It took me a couple of weeks, but I think that uh, since I've been here, that's something that not only me, but the rest of the guys have been, have been bought into. Um, I think that's something that we will continue to buy into because we, we really believe in it. Sometimes as a player, I'm sure you think you're just playing balls out. Do you ever disagree with his loafs or when you look at tape, do you say, yeah, I could have done more? Uh, nah, usually, you know, usually, you know, uh, sometimes it's a pretty tough grade, but, uh, that's the standard and that's the expectation that we hold each other to. So, uh, I think for the most part, you pretty much know when you, when you gave it y'all and you can't, that's something you can't really hide, you know. Joel Erickson. Kari, uh, how, uh, how tough has this season been for you physically You've on the injury report with like a bunch of different things? Um, and, and played all but one game. What, how, how tough has it been physically? Uh, it's the NFL football season. I think, uh, you know, I've been I've been battling with some nicks and things here and there, uh, causing me to only miss one game. So I've been very fortunate, especially what I've been uh, battling with. So uh, I think you know, as far as injury goes, those are part of the game. Uh, if I can play, I'm playing, you know, um, but if not, then I'm not. So uh, it ain't too much going to keep me off the field unless it's something that's enable me but it's been uh I feel like everybody's been dealing with that across the league you know thankfully I've been blessed enough for it to not be anything catastrophic so uh, we're just gonna keep chugging along and uh take them as they come hey, can you say what you've been dealing with I think they've been on the report uh I think I had a quad back stuff like that so everything has been on the report Zach Kiefer Hey, Kari, um, Kenny's catch on Sunday. Have you ever seen anything like that in your life? And could you just walk us through kind of what you saw from your angle and how you processed it as a fellow defensive back? Yeah, I was on the other side of the field. Um, I think it's probably the best catch I ever witnessed uh, as a football player on any level, uh, practice, game, anything, or just how high he got up and uh, how he didn't, he didn't double catch it. Like he just snagged it. And I think uh, from my angle, I just remember him, you know, falling back off of a seven or out in the corner of the end zone um, that, we, that he knew they liked. Uh, his, his, he actually fell off. He was on a short one and fell off to the deep one. Uh, so it was a lot of, you know, football smarts there. And I just seen him climb the ladder. I actually thought he, he went up and, and got a hand on it, like batted it out. But this was once I saw his, like, his, cuffing the ball like his hand was coming up and like a cuffing angle. Once I started out, I said, oh, no, I know this dude did not just do what I think he did. He did. So it was a very exciting moment for not only him, but for all of us. George Bremer. Curry had the pick six on Sunday. When's the last time you scored a touchdown before that? High school. Yeah. <laughs> My best friends was messing with me. They said I ain't touched the paint since high school. <laughs> what uh there's such a huge emphasis on takeaways with this defense coach Eberflus just said that starts in practice how do you deal with that on a day-to-day -day basis to make sure you're ready for things like that on, on game day yeah I think we we practice it and uh we practice it uh consistently you know uh Flus and what he what he preach and our coaching staff and even us as players you know uh usually you sometimes you can start the year off practicing something and as the season weighs on you, you get away from it. But I think, um, you know, we've been able to kind of, uh, you know, continue to have those turnovers because it's something that we, we, we stay on. It's something that we preach, something that we stay on, something that we execute, you know, day in and day out in practice. So uh, what you're seeing um, from everybody, I think you're just a byproduct of what we're doing uh, throughout the week. Ken Bone. Hey, Kari, uh, when you face Watson in this offense, just how different is that from typically what you see on a weekend, week out basis? Obviously, every team has their own wrinkle, but just how unique of a challenge is, is that quarterback? Yeah, it's, he presents challenges. You know, all, they got challenges all across the board. You know, he could, he could run it. He can throw it. He's a strong guy, smart football player, um, you know, a great competitor. Uh, whenever you're playing against a guy, with, you know, not just physical abilities, but, you know, who 
you can see his involvement, you know, year to year, with, you know, his throwing and reading defenses and stuff like that. It's going to present a challenge. I think it's a challenge that, you know, uh, we're up for. It's a challenge that we're excited about. We'll be back home. Um, it's, uh, it's a divisional opponent, you know, respectable opponent. We know each other. Um, and they got a great, great quarterback and other other good weapons. And I think we, we have, uh, you know, great leaders on our defense and great weapons that's, that's up for the challenge. We'll go last question, Joel Erickson. Ari, I know you, you kind of came into this season saying you wanted to uh, create more turnovers and obviously you got a couple picks, but uh, how, how do you feel like you've played overall and, and adjusted here in your second year in the NFL? I don't really know. I think I have to probably sit back and uh, and look at it all as a, as a body of work or something once the season is over. But I think I've taken, I know I've gotten better. I take strides and, you know, in the, in the right direction and trying to be the player that uh, this defense need me to be. I feel like that's that's more so what I've been focusing on, what I've been trying to do, and they need me to turn the ball over. Uh, I got two. I'm looking to get some more. Uh, just give our give our team the best opportunity to achieve our goals, and that's what I want to know each week.